What's up guys? Today I'm going to be doing a review on the iPod Nano. As you can see here. Um, at the bottom, first of all, there's the uh, headphone jack right there. And then the USB cable, I think is what it's called. It's a very thin device. Um, and it has the lock up there. And the unlock button. Um, here it has the menu. Uh, the forward and backward button, and I guess what I call it, and then play pause. I'll unlock it for you guys. And then, so it has the down bar thing or whatever you want to call it at the bottom. And then you can hear, I'll just put the song real quick. You won't be able to hear it or anything, but I'll just do. This one, um, you won't be able to hear it though. It's a nipple, nickelback song. Um, the volume is to turn it up like this. To turn it down that way. Also, if you hit the home, home button, I guess, as a middle button, you get these, like, few options. You can give it a star rating. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. Oh, and you can turn and shuffle it off or whatever. But yeah. That's with the iPod Nano, I want to say third generation. This is pretty much all about, um, the settings, I guess I could show you. Let me get there. Um, in the settings, it just says the about. Um, how much it's used, um, if it's an Apple iPod, how much it's used, I already said that, but how much, like, um, audio, video, photos, other, and free space, and then it just has how many songs, videos, podcasts, photos, games, and contacts are on here, and then, like, the serial number and stuff like that. Um, also in the settings, you have shuffle, repeat, playback, you can have EQ, which has a bunch of different, like, options here. Um, soundtrack, I don't really know what that is, comment below if you do. Um, volume limit, you can have it up to there. All the way down there. Um, audio crossfade, um, which I really don't like that actually. It's when you go into the next song, I think. It is when you go to the next song, um, the next song will fade into, their, into the last song. I don't like that really at all. You can have audiobooks on here, I guess. Um, you can shake the shuffle. The energy saver. In the general settings, you have the clicker, both, off, speaker, and headphones. I'll just have it on both. Um, you can have the rotate pump flow, backlight. Um, you can have uh, off, um, two seconds, whatever, always on. In the setting or brightness, you can have really bright or really dark. Which I guess I'll just have really bright dark right now, just so you guys can see. Um, font size. Ooh, font size. You can have a large or standard. Um, main menu settings and music menu. I'm not gonna go into those. And short. Sort contacts first, last, and yeah. So that's pretty much what's all on the iPod, you know, but, um, I don't really know what else to tell you about. Uh, but yeah, I don't really know what else to tell you guys. Just so that if you want to just listen to music or audiobooks, if you can, um, go out and get this, 
but otherwise if you want to do more stuff go out and get the iPod touch because it's more useful or if you even want to go bigger go get the uh, iPad or the iPhone if you want a phone um, but I mean if you just want to listen to music get this it's the cheapest out of three or four whatever I said so yeah hope you enjoyed this video I'm sorry if I just kind of rambled on but you know there's not much to say, so I wanted to keep it longer. So yeah, see you guys later. Peace.